hello friends welcome to my channel code blocks in this video i tell you how to run java program from chrome and prompt okay and uh, everyone know that uh, um, the structure of the main method is public static void main string args okay so in the earlier video i told you what is this string edges basically it's an array of string that stores command line argument okay command line argument or parameter so basically command line argument means the argument that passed from the command prompt okay that passed from command prompt now we uh, now comes to the um, main point uh, the how to run java program from command prompt okay so first of all we have to create a um, java file uh, into the uh, into your desktop or pc okay and after that you have to run first of all to run java program you, ha you have to write this command okay java c and then file name okay that means anything dot java for run and uh, for execution purpose and uh, this is uh, actually not for run this is for compile okay this is for compile and now to run your java program after compile you have to write java and then class name okay then class name and then you have to write the parameters of the argument that you are trying to pass from the command prompt okay anything okay you can write game or anything anything you can you, you try to passes from the command prompt and okay so these two steps you have to remember So now comes to implement section okay and first of all i am uh, create a um, command um, folder in the in my desktop and now i am creating a java file using notepad so i am write the java code okay public static void main string args system dot out dot print args of zero okay because ARG is an a string a array of string okay and we are trying to print the uh, first the first parameter of first argument now save it insert the command folder and uh, name it comment dot java okay now you have to uh, go to command prompt and now uh, i am creating the folder at uh, desktop so i have to go desktop and then i have to go the folder created folder that is command and now i have to first of all we have to compile the code okay so that's why i have to write java c and the file name okay so command dot java command dot java so now uh, after compile you you will be able to see that the one uh, dot class file will, will be generated this is known as the byte code okay after uh, compiling the java code uh, one dot class file will be generated and after that you have to run 
the java code for run for execution purpose you have to write java then class name okay the class name is command and thereafter you have to write the parameter anything you have to write okay i am write uh, game here okay and now click enter okay now here you can see that the game will print here okay and one more thing if you try to print more, more than one parameter or more than one argument then if you have to change one thing you have to change your code once again now take a for loop for integer i is equal to 0 i less than rgs dot length i plus plus okay and one more thing i am creating one so now save this file okay now again go to your command prompt and again you have to compile your code okay so java c command dot java and now you have to run your code java and then class name command and then you you can uh, passes the parameter that you want okay so first of all cricket now first of all i'm right here game then space give space then cricket and then give another space then you can write football okay and hit enter okay so you can now see that the game cricket and football these three parameters are printed here okay so using this uh, using this way you can uh, run the java program using command prompt and you can pass this argument from command prompt and that's that argument are stored in the string args that are that are written or that are used in the main method of java okay so that's all for this video